In this episode of Wing Sauce, we're getting stuck into some more stubs, and this one is the chipotle <laughs> butter. Welcome back, Wing fans. Welcome to another episode. Uh, this week, we are getting stuck into some chipotle. Chipotle? Ch yeah, we're getting into Chipot chipotle. Chipotle. No, I, th I think you're overthinking it. Just back yourself, son. Chipotle. Chipotle. We're getting stuck into some chipotle. Nailed it. More of the stubs. More of stubs, yes. So, uh, this is a chipotle butter. Mm. So, this is probably, in my mind, a wing traditional sauce. Could be like a Like you've got buffalo, and I feel like chipotle is yeah, a big part of that. Yeah. Like, as in... Like they're two different things, obviously, but like they're. So the chipotle, uh, just for, for the uh, fans mm. out there who don't know, mm. um, it's a dried, smoked um, jalapeno. Mm. There you go. Um, that's so that's where the extra flavour comes in. That smoky, dried, um, fun that just sort of creeps mm. through everything. That, that intrinsic flavour that you get with chipotle that oh, I love. Mm. So it's jalapeno, you said. Yes. So for wing fans, which aren't 100% across um, chipotle. Chipotle. Uh, chipotle. I it's, feel like uh, I'm a Mexican when I, I need a big hat. Yeah, you should do. It's like um, a jalapeno, but more fun. Um, they uh, smoke it and dry it, mm. um, and you know, it gives that extra bit of flavor okay. on top of your uh, already fun jalapeno, which I love. And jalapenos, uh, for those playing at home, on the Scoville yeah. scale? Between three and a half uh, and 10,000, so right. I think it will just depend on, on who's doing it and where they're from, yeah, and all right. that sort of stuff. So it's so. well down, you're not gonna get your, uh, you're not gonna get any of this action out of, um, out of a standard chipotle, I guess, no, because it's, it's going to be a lot milder. Uh, but I guess you could probably really work that up, and maybe that's something we can do S as far as... Stubbs he thinks you should, because he's attached an injector. Yeah. Tell us about that, John. Yeah, yeah so uh, on this one, we've got the injector. So obviously, something like this you can use with all your types of meats. Uh, it is a pretty tricky technique. Mm. I think it takes a few times to nail it. On the chicken wing side of things, though, you can't go too wrong. Mm. Um, great sort of injector here, and you can just put it in there. Um, pre-cooked, so it really sort of marinates the inside as well and gives you that flavour. Soaks in. Big all-round flavour. And that's and what we've used to inject pain and suffering. Yes. And exactly. it's a good it's a it's a good quality unit too. Like it's all stainless steel and the uh, the needle. needle bit. Yep. Um, syringe, good yeah. bit of kit. And yes. it's got a couple of little holes in it, so it's yeah, it's a good pretty size rad that comes plenty with of, it. So. Um, plenty of sauce in there and something mm. like this butter. Obviously, uh, anyone that knows you put a bit of butter into to meat and oh, delicious. Um, good so stuff. Hopefully that's what we'll get today. Cool. Yep. Uh, we've gone the wing of death, uh, of course, as always. Uh, this week we've gone for a double tap on the uh, Scorpion Strike, uh, same as uh, this episode. You can see um, uh, the, the episode link in the description there, but we'll put it up, up here as well. Now this is the one that bailed you up last time, isn't it? I got this one uh, last time, and uh, it's warm. It's very warm. I almost think, now, so... <laughs> We should have, we should have oh, I've had two. You yeah. guys have had one. We, we should, need to, like, we should have a leaderboard. Or something. We should have a leaderboard. Yeah. We should like put it like yeah. up on the board or something. Yeah. We should have a leaderboard. Let us know what you think about that. Yeah. We, might, uh, we might start implementing that. But I'm winning. Yep. If you can. Yeah. You're a winner. I guess. Yeah. I'm a winner. <laughs> I'm a winner. Yes. <laughs> so, and I had this last time and having had both, the Reaper and that, I think that's hotter. Yeah. You didn't know you didn't know much about it at first though. You, you consumed it and you're I like, thought it, I, th I thought I didn't have it. I think it got me. And then all of a sudden and it became into, a I was into my second wing. Anyway, check out the video and, yep. and uh, uh, you'll see all about it. These are like smelling awesome. And so getting cold. Get stuck yeah. in, so. I want that one because it looks the darkest. Oh Dude, man, do, 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 please do. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. They smell great. Yeah. Mm. Oh man. Wow. Big smoky flavours in that. They yeah. are, aren't they? Very much so, hey. Like we, it's, um, yeah, very sort of smoky. Yeah, I mean, there's more, more charcoal on these wings than the last one too, so I think they're just sort of sitting on there, tasting fantastic. So chipotle peppers, tomato paste. Yep. Red chilli flakes, onion powder, garlic. Yeah, you can definitely taste that garlic. A apple cider vinegar? Yep. For a bit of that's your acidity, okay. molasses. That's why it's that's why it sticks to it. Mm -hmm. I'm getting them just awesome. to heat out of it. Bit really, of garlic. Yeah, really taking a while to um, 
taste the heat for that. Same. I saw that coming though. Um, <laughs> any any wing sauce with an injector for more heat on the side of it doesn't fill you with confidence it's going to be a, a hot wing. Um, but yeah, but some of the great sauces aren't. Um, and it's yeah, Chipotle, right? right? So, yep, yeah, me too. Um, I'm going to back off this time. I'm going to let you guys get it. <laughs> Because you did, you you uh, st I had, I had statistically a, attacked. It. I had a theory and thought, okay, if I go get number wing number four, if number three, there's three left. Get number four, work it all out, and it didn't work. I made it through, I think. You made it through. Yeah. Tell me you're you're warming up there. Um, jeez, jazz. These are salty, Johnny. Hmm. I've noticed. Um, and maybe that's that's part of the, the smokiness. Um, or I don't know, actually. You're right. That's um, that real. And it, I think in just that 30 seconds that I ate that first wing, they were cooling down a bit. It seems to become more prevalent. I'm a big salt fan. So I look for that. I look for that real um, savory um, vibe and I'm enjoying that. Yeah, I think that's kicking in. You got Johnny it. Johnny got it. You got it, I don't. But I, I'm getting definitely a, um, a warm. <laughs> you just started getting really quiet. <laughs> it's just like, mm. just thinking about it. <laughs> Trying to will it not to happen. I think what I think I'm just, um, it hasn't quite hit the mouth yet. I've just got mm. that glow just hit my, you, my you, face straight away. You've got away. a colour. <laughs> I was like, ah. Oh. Yeah. Nailed him. Um, so, Did for you me, like it? I, I, I was, um, well, we'll... we'll uh, hit it in the verdict, we'll but you know, your thoughts? Well, um, yeah, I think it's almost like a bit of worst. A bit of Worcestershire sauce yeah. for those that um, yeah. know what that is. We'll, we'll um, put a little picture up of that, but mm. you, I mean, everyone knows what that is, right? Yeah. It almost has a little bit of that flavour. Yeah, it does. It's, it's quite yeah. savoury. Yeah. I'm tasting a lot of um, a, a lot of beefy um, stock cubey kind of. Yeah, it totally does. Um, really savoury flavours in it, and uh, I think that it would be fun if it was if it was a bit spicier because mm. all the flavours there it just needs to be elevated a little bit more. With some, with some chili. Yeah, and I think um, being that they've already got those chili flakes in there, mm -hmm. for our custom uh, sauces, yep. uh, which you'll start seeing appearing on the channel, be keen to do one with this actually, and start Mo to really ramp some heat in it. Yeah, modified up. I think that's what I'd do with this sort of sauce. I know that you can use this with pretty much uh, on the back here. It's got all your types Everything. of um, your meats in there. I'd probably inject this into a chicken wing if I was going to do it again, mm. uh, and then. Um, have another another flavour on top of it just to get an underlying taste. Mm -hmm. For me, I probably wouldn't go straight up um, just this on a on a chicken style yep. one. How's, how's, how's the ring of fire going? Is it, you seem all right. You yeah, seem good. I think I um I don't know what happened there. It's sort of a quick That's glow and just gone. Just moved on. Yeah. It's done on the grenade. Yes. Yeah. So one thing's clear: we need to up the amount uh, of this that, that we're, we're adding. Yeah. Um, because you bastards. Because the two that I've got have been that last one. The first slot I had of this was. Mm. Uh, we have to have a little sit down uh, mm. after we had that one. So, anyway, mm. we'll uh, head on to the verdict. What did you think, Matt? Uh, I thought it was great, uh, but I'm going to consider it uh, for me personally. Uh, the way I'm going to catalogue it in the mind is a good base, a good starting point. Um, if I was to just treat it, uh, look at it the way it is out of the bottle, it's a bit of a letdown because of what I've enjoyed from Stubbs before. Okay. The Stubbs uh, wing sauce uh, original is um, shit hot, I'll say. I'm going to come out and say it's fantastic, and mm. um, which is probably what led to my uh, mild disappointment about this sauce. Okay. Um, having said that, it didn't. It did have uh, some great things about it. It was salty. It was savoury. It had. It was. Um, beef stocky, brothy, it had all those really good um, flavours I'm chasing. Yeah, it just okay. let me down a little bit with um, with the heat, but I, I guarantee you, if you throw um, some chilli in that, a little bit of cayenne, it's just going to be amazing because yeah. it, it's going to it's going to attach itself to all those beautiful savoury flavours, which I enjoyed. The saltiest we've had so far. Would I buy it again? Absolutely. Cool. Uh, well, for me, um, carrying on from what you're saying there, I, I'm, I think for me, like knowing it wasn't going to be uh, being Chipotle, it wasn't going to be a, a crazy hot sauce. So if that's what you're chasing, then, then happy days. And I think that's kind of like if you know where you're at and you want something, you have something that's like a lot hotter, and, and you had something like this, um, it's pretty easy to add some heat, and, yep. and you'll see in those vids that we do. Yeah. Um, but for me, I think it should be encouraged too. Yeah. You know, fiddle with your heat. Yeah, and, and I guess some, but some well, depending on how you're traveling. Yeah. Um, for me, it was very. Uh, I don't know, I just can't get the, the Worcestershire type sauce yep. flavour, that real sort of stocky, 
uh, type flavor, but then you had some heat there and uh, some of that general sort of smokiness as yep. well. So um, I'm a big I'm a big fan of of that sort of smoky type flavor. Big fan of it in scotches. Big fan of it uh, off the grill as well. So um, yeah, I loved it. I would definitely go again. How about you, mate? Um, you still with us? Yep, I'm, I'm, still, I'm uh, upset. I'm upset that he's not uh, in more of a mess right now. Exactly it's right. He's more of a man. That's what it is. Um, so nothing to report him. Right. Okay. What, so, did, what did you think? So my sort of um, thoughts on this one, I probably wouldn't go it again. Um, I probably will use whatever I've got left here uh, yep. to inject and maybe do a dry rub uh, on the wing. Yep. Ooh. Um, but for mm. me, slightly different flavors are probably what floats my boat with um, chicken wings. So okay. uh, give it one more go, but. Um, as an overall wing sauce, probably probably not what I'm Swing and a miss. Chatting. All right, cool. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Uh, we did. We did, that's for sure. Yeah. I'm, uh, I'm keen for more. Lucky we have some more just over there uh, <laughs> that we'll probably be getting stuck into. That's all about stubs and the Chipotle butter. Mm -hmm. um, Next week we have a surprised guest appearance uh, for the sauce, so keep an eye out for that. We're pretty pretty excited about it. Excited. Be great. It's be fantastic. Looking forward to that. Um, as always, check out the description. We have all the details for uh, this particular stubs down there as well, um, as well as uh, our pain saw. And I think on that one, just because you can use it with a bit of anything, throw something in the comments there if you enjoy it with something else. Um, give us yeah, any yeah. sort of suggestions there. Yeah. We'd love to, uh, to try it on some different meats mm. and, and how you use just it. Give us some wing back. <laughs> some wing back. Take I love it. <laughs> Oh, we've got wing scosity. Yeah, wing got, scosity, uh, wing scales, and wing back. Genius. Make sure you follow us on Facebook as always, and of course, hit the subscribe button. Find us on Instagram where it all started for us, um, and we look forward to joining you next week. Thanks. See you then. Thanks, wing fans. <laughs>